right, Jay, thanks so much. Well, the source of clean air in your home may actually be hanging out in those house plants. NASA study showed they improved the air, taking out up to 87% of toxins in just 24 hours. Our good friend and contributing author to the book, Ultimate Gardener, Jerry Johnson is back with us this morning. She's gonna let us know, okay, really, seriously. Let's talk about the science here. These little plants can actually filter the air for us. Exactly. And impact our lives. They add humidity, they take out toxins, and add oxygen to your air. I love this idea, and it's a pretty way to do it. Much, not that those air purifiers aren't nice, but it's much prettier than one of those brown boxes in the corner of the room. I agree. Let's talk about what the different plants do for us. Um, you actually can walk us through the different rooms. Which room do you want to start in? Um, how about that ivy over there? Well, in your bedroom, uh, you can add ivy, but it's wonderful in the office. Believe it or not, it improves concentration. Oh, bring on the ivy. <laughs> I'm loving that. Um, what about another source for our office space to really help us impact uh, not only, you know, it's going to look great, but it's also going to, you say, impact our abilities to get our jobs done, right? Exactly. Purple is uh -huh. a great color, and for some reason, when we look at purple like an African violet, uh, our creativity is increased because adrenaline is released, as oh, well yeah. as our mood is increased, um, and we're supposed to be less stressed. Oh, I need a couple of those, too. <laughs> All right, uh, the containers, uh, we've got some different colors that you're bringing out. I recognize there are some um, different plants here. Which room are we talking about for uh, some of these other containers? Where do you want to go next here? Well, we've got, we oh, have a peace, peace lily. Yes, peace lilies, believe it or not, are great for the bathroom. Okay. They remove yes, bold, they mold out of bathrooms. Really? Yes, I couldn't believe that myself, but it does. And also, um, acetone, if you use uh -oh, nail polish nail. remover, <laughs> and it I takes do. it out of the air. Hey, neat. Oh, um, ferns. There's a big, beautiful fern over here. Okay, that's a good for which room? Your bedroom. Oh. To increase your sleep. That's going to get me more sleep? No, I'm sorry. That's the one that moisturizes your skin. Oh, okay. So that helps get, get, cut yes. down on the wrinkles. But it, I think these are the guys who help us sleep better, right? right? Are these Gerber daisies? They are because they actually work reverse of other plants. Oh, yeah? They work at night. And so they increase oh. your sleep by as much as 10%. Hey, I'll take it. In fact, I'm going to take this one with me. <laughs> I know Julie and Jay might fight me over that one. <laughs> These are some wonderful ideas, Joe Ray. We love it when you come up and visit us and share these ideas. And you know, like I said, she's a contributing author to the great book, The Ultimate Gardener. And she is uh, always looking over for great ways for us to implement plants and gardening into our lives and make us happy and smile. And thank you for sharing these secrets today. Thank you. Jay, Julie.